So let's take a look at the Keynote app and creating a simple animation uh, using the Keynote app. It's a terrific underutilized um, app. So I'm just gonna delete these bits here and let's bring in a simple shape. And we're just gonna move this circle here up to where we want it, the animation to start. And then when I press on the slide on the left-hand side, you can see transition. We're gonna select a magic move and it's going to say, do you wanna copy? Yes, we do. Um, if we go back to the first one and click on the magic move, it gives us some options. And we're going to say after the previous transition, um, we want the next slide to start. I'll put that at two seconds. Click on the second slide and now we're gonna move that to where we want it to go. So I'm just gonna move it down the bottom. And then I'm gonna repeat that process. So now I'm gonna select that slide. We're gonna select uh, effects, magic move, yes. Make sure we click on that one and actually select the um, options, which is after previous. And we'll do that um, one more time. So on the third one here, we're simply gonna move that up to the top and that should be us done. So we should, if we look up the top there, it should start there, move to the ones, and the magic move is a fantastic one to use with transition. So let's press uh, done, and now press play to see if our transition works. Fantastic, and that's it. So that's a really simple animation using uh, the Keynote app, um, and you can see some real, um, potential here with this. You can see physics, uh, you can see just logical sequential kind of work. Uh, we can include some sound effects, we can include explosions instead of just moving, uh, they can fall apart. We can look at angles of um, incidents and angles of reflection and um, all those sorts of things that we can look at. So there's the Keynote app, creating simple animations using the magic move and moving around shapes.